Within the Samsung SmartThings Starter Kit, one of the uh, devices you get with it is one of the uh, present sensors, that's this device here. So I'm just gonna share my screen and show you how easy it is to register that in the Samsung SmartThings app. Okay, but unlock my phone. Um, so what I have here is a um, Apple iOS device. So I'm going to go into the SmartThings app. Use my fingerprint to authentication, and it's a Home and Plus. So it's now looking for new devices. Okay. So I believe that's the one that's coming in. See any other new device? So if I select all that. What you could do is you could rename it. So it might be that you want to put that device on something, like if you had a pet dog, um, or it might be you want to put it um, on a bike, or it could be that you want to put it um, in something else of, of a high value that, that may leave the premises. And then every time um, that device leaves, you'll receive a push notification via the SmartThings app on your phone. So let me just do that. I'm going to rename it to dog. So I'm not going to put it on the, on the collar. So let me just save. Okay. So that's done. So if you see then, I go in. It shows you the battery life. Uh, it shows you, you know, the last time that that arrived or, or left at the house and there's any activity. Um, what you then have the ability to do if you wanted to was start to create um, kind of like routines so that maybe this device was enabled when certain something happened. So it could be that when you leave the house and your phone leaves the house, that's when that device is enabled. So it doesn't have to be sort of a very linear on or off. It can be that it becomes part of a routine. Of a routine. So there we go. That's how simple it is to add that. Um, thanks for your time.